All right, it's just your man Style Con coming at you again with another video. Once again, as a refined gentleman, you don't just want a nice watch, a nice pen. You need some nice artwork in your house to represent who you are as a person. And I have a very special gentleman. Uh, he's from the local area, fellow cigar smoker. Uh, Jim, I, I call him Rocky Patel. If you see him in the video, he sort of looks like Rocky a little bit. And he's going to explain the process of doing some of his artwork and then we're going to show you some of his artwork. Hey, thanks Keith. Uh, James Rowland here. Uh, this is just a quick uh, view of my humble uh, studio here in the corner. Uh, some pieces that I'm working on right now for a gentleman that requested uh, uh, he's a Ravens fan, but um, this is going to be a, um, a Raven when it's finished. Uh, so I'm working on this now. And as Keith said, um, this artwork can enhance any space that you see fit. And that just and that's not just confined to your home and your in your living spaces, but your office, your corporate center, those kinds of things. So keep that in mind. Um, just wanted to show you a little bit of where it begins, where the magic happens, and uh, this is where I get into my process. So for right now, this is my, my humble studio. Thank you. All right. Now, this is where the magic begins. Now, let's show you some of the magic after it's been produced. All right. Now, let's look at some of these pieces of artwork. Actually, I'm really impressed. I didn't know that he had this in him. I've known him for years. I didn't know he was an artist. And I'm thoroughly impressed. I'm ready to take a couple of pieces home with me. Except for it might break the bank towards the next watch. But he might work me out a deal. Come on. Like and subscribe. He he, he might hit me off. Alright. You want to explain some of the uh, Thanks, pieces Steve. of artwork? Sure, sure. Um, we were upstairs a little while ago looking at my humble studio. And here are some of the finished pieces. Uh, which again I say can be uh, fit any uh, any room, office space, corporate center, anything of that nature. Um, you bring it together with the colors and, and the, the vibrant brilliance of, of color, and um, and it can enhance uh, any any space at all, living space, uh, your living room, anywhere at all. These are some of the recent ones that I've I've, I've produced. Uh, that I'm pretty proud of. Uh, this one in the center showcasing this one in particular, that's one of my favorites. But again, upon request, we'll work with uh, what colors you're, um, that you have in mind and, uh, and, and what kind of shapes you might want. And again, uh, these are mostly abstracts, uh, but the brilliance and the beauty of abstract is you can see a lot of different things in abstract. So when someone looks at my pieces and my work, they'll see something that I might not have seen. And I want to show you one in particular, if Keith doesn't mind, and I know we might have it in another segment, but um, this is one that I call Faces of Chaos. Now, it is one of my favorite pieces, and if you look on my Facebook page uh, and see it anywhere, and here in particular, you'll notice how many faces that you can actually see in this corner here. Um, there's a larger face here, kind of a um, um, terminator kind of thing with a, a right eye here, a left eye here, the nose, the skull. And then if you, if you block that off, you can see some smaller faces with an eye and a nose and things like that. But those are just the, the, the beauty of, of, of abstract art. Uh, and it can, it can, enhance anything and I, and I really love it but and thanks for uh and thanks for letting me bring it to you appreciate it all right well i can't let you go just yet he has a painting that i am really thoroughly impressed i like the samurai painting that he did but he has another one that uh he has i think this is beautiful this is one of my um earlier ones this is called um i've entitled this one asian sunset and uh, Keith really likes the colors and, and, and the action and a lot of the, the uh, fluidity that's going on here. So, and again, you can have geometric shapes, you can have flow moving, you can have objects, you can have anything you want. 
and um, and that's the beauty of it and I'm really excited when I do these kinds of things and uh, images and colors and shapes come come to mind but uh, that's yeah. one he really likes as well oh I, I love all of them I, that's not that's one of my favorite ones no doubt but when you think about it when as Jim was saying that you have a fine piece of uh, horology on your wrist some uh, person took the time out to build it to make it to produce it they hand engrave it they do this this gentleman is putting that type of love into this artwork i mean this is definitely beautiful it's something different it's unique i haven't seen too many pieces like these and i do like my art and that can set you out from the next gentleman. So you have a nice Rolex on your wrist, but you go to your house, you got Walmart pictures on your wall. Does that really do anything? That's not impressing the chicks. Now, when you come home and you have something like this on your wall, that's going to be signed by the actual artist. This actually says volumes about you and your style. Once again, it's your man, StyleCon. Thank you for taking the time out of your day to watch my video. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below. And this is a topic for discussion. I will leave Jim's uh, Facebook page and uh, Instagram page uh, links down below. If you want to check his artwork out, you can. He does commission work, so whatever you're into, he can accommodate you. And you can be that stylish guy, not just with that watch, not just with that pen, but you got some beautiful artwork on your walls. And I will check you out in the next video.